Hi, I'm Irina. I teach English at Clarendon Sixth Form. In English language, um, we love curious minds and we have lots of topics which will occupy you. So, for example, um, we look at language and gender and we also look at language change. So, to see how language has changed through time, we look at language and occupation. So, looking at different jobs and different ways in which you talk in each of these occupations. We also look to see how children learn language. So, looking at language acquisition and looking at how babies learn language from the very start. So, there's lots of things that we do in language um, uh, when you learn language. It's a really interesting course, and we welcome you. If you decide to come to Clarendon, you will find the class sizes in each subject are quite smaller and so therefore you have lots of one-to-one -one tuition and it means I can get round and, and see what you are all doing in the class um, in that one session. Okay, we study lots of topics, um, one of which is accent and dialect. We will look at Mancunian accent first and seeing what kind of accent we have and we also look at the London accent, the southern accent, to see whether there is an actual divide, is it north and south divide and you know, are we less posh than our um, friends in, in the south? So you, you get to understand how, what kind of accent you have and what dialect is all about and is, is dialect diminishing? Is it something that's, that's going? Um, is it leaving us? So it, it really is worthwhile to uh, learn English because you learn about all the things to do with English in society. We do have, for English language, we do have quite a number of guest speakers that come in. Um, we've recently had a journalist come in and talk to our students about what it's like being a journalist and it was quite surprising, all the little jobs that he has to do. Um, it, wasn't, it wasn't that easy getting into the job, but it was nice to have him in, come in and talking to our English language students about that. In terms of progression, if you do an English language, you um, can progress to do all, all kinds of things. All you have to do is have a look and see all these famous people. Ian Hislop has an example um, in How I Got News For You. Um, he, he studies English and look what he's doing now. And the, there are so many things that you can do. So for example, you can be a journalist, um, you can go into politics, um, and you can certainly go into law because being able to understand the English language and getting the gist of what you're reading and what you're communicating will ensure that you progress. So if you're ready to tackle the English language, um, we love people with curious minds, we love people with an open-minded approach, you'll be able to tackle all kinds of texts and all kinds of communication. Um, come and see us, come and talk to us, we'll be happy to welcome you here.